Y'all ready? Let's get it, let's get it. Let's go, move, move. Mark Rose, I'll tell you what, I'm excited. Derek down here giving back to the community and helping these kids out. He's risen to the top of the football world, but always humble and grateful and willing to give back. We're excited about being down here to help the kids in Tallahassee. Tremendous leader for me in those uh, great teams we had here. Uh, steadily and quickly risen up the ranks. He's a, obviously a shooting star in the football world. Very proud of him. We stay in touch and speak. It's just a blessing. I'm so proud of him. Brandon Hall. DA put something together as far as the camp for the kids. You've, you've camped the first time doing it. Just going to get the kids moving around, man. Make them have a little fun. Teach them some fundamentals. Do some agility work with them. Stretch them out. Do some offense and defense stuff with them. But the main thing is they, they flying around having some fun, man. It's a good thing he's doing for the community. Oh, me and DA played college football together at Troy. Came in together. Matter of fact, same class, the class of 2000. We met up and took pictures on OA News um, signing day, and we've been tight ever since, man. Kevin Jordan, we're very excited about it. Derek's a, a former Tallahassee player. It, it's great to have him back into town. I know we've got about 200 kids pre-registered and looking for some more walk-ups. Just very excited about it, you know, giving back to the community. DA, man, unbelievable worker. Just a great guy and an, and an unbelievable worker. And, you know, he's doing a great job of giving back to the community here in Tallahassee. Just good to see him. Derek has gotten to where he's at because of his hard work and the the way he carries himself. Uh, Jamel King, just excited to be here, come out and work with Coach DA. A lot of great things, give back to his community. It's just amazing to be here. My first cousin is a high school football coach. They played together at Troy, so the connection was there. Just an opportunity to come out here and get around some culture with experience and be able to uh, get better. John Kitchens. Uh, today's camp, man, I love to give back to the kids, man. I reached out to Coach Ansley a few weeks ago. I saw he was advertising it every day. I saw it on Facebook, Twitter, and such forth, and just thought it'd be a good opportunity to come out here and help. Uh, when I used to coach at Lynette High School, Coach Ansley coached at Alabama. He was at Kentucky would come back and recruit some of our kids obviously in the area that he always does and then when he's at Tennessee he met him just working camps together in the past when he was at Alabama. LeBron Stewart awesome great to be back uh hometown played on this field you know dad coach still uncle coach still you know man just be able to give back to the community oh you know, that's my, now, my cousin you know we grew up together you know right down the road man playing football in the kudzu I remember him running around the street in his shorts and no shoes you know being able to watch him uh, through his high school career and uh, on the Troy and and you know to do great things there so just to see him uh, to be able to want to give back um, is big for this community. Hunter Adams, Derek and I grew up competing against each other as crosstown rivals. I went to Elmore County High School, he went to Tallahassee. We played together at Troy University man. Uh, I'm excited about what he's doing. It should be a huge turnout for all the kids in the River Region. Tremendous amount of coaches and players here to instruct, to teach, and to just to bring energy and excitement to the camp. Smartest football player I've ever played with man. He commanded the meeting rooms, was absolute field general, unbelievable competitor. If I ever call, ask for drill tape, ask for insight on something, he's quick to get it to me, man. So he's always been uh, solid. D. Milner, camp's going to be a great day, going to be a great turnout, man. Doing this for the kids. My cousin, uh, Derek, man, is doing a great thing for the kids. The first one, I hope for many. I hope the kids come out, great turnout, we're going to have fun, we're going to enjoy ourselves. It's going to be a good day. Coaching when I was at Alabama, just been helping me out all through my life, man. I've been knowing since I was a kid. Just a great guy. I've always been down to earth. I always really want to come back and give the folks and always, you know, give his all and care about people, man. Thank the world of D.A. He's somebody who uh, has almost been like a mentor to me back from the rivalry days of Tyler in Real Town and then me going to play at Huntington, him coming back to coach, spending some time with him there, him as a coach, me as a player finishing up. Stayed in touch with him everywhere he's been. I tried to go and just soak up knowledge from him. He's just always been a, a great for me and just trying to return the favor, help him out today and get his foundation going and, and giving back to the community. I think it's going to be great. Hats off to him for, for having a, the servant's heart to give back to his community and, uh, and doing it the right way. First name, Justin, last name, Brian. Today count, we basically going to go over fundamentals with the kids. We're going to run a couple stations, check out agility, fundamentals, and then probably do like a sprint off at the end. And we just here to have fun. DA, high school mentor um, while I was in uh, school uh, back in the day. And also he was my coach in college. I played at Huntington College. I was a defensive back. Went on after that and just kept a good relationship with him. Randy Bryant, first ever Derek Ansley Driven Athletes football camp today here in Tallahassee. DA and I go back to Troy. Uh, I was a student coach. He was a player. Uh, we were in each other's weddings, have stayed in contact through the years. We got a uh, kids camp sponsored by DA and his foundation, man. Gonna have a great opportunity to really work some kids out and give back to the community that engaged so much, not only DA, but to myself as well. Like my brother, man, we play ball against each other. You know, he from Tallahassee, I'm from real town. We just family, man. Talk once a week, just family, man, that's it. Coach Angeles came back from Los Angeles to come back to his hometown to show some love to the kids, man. Several, several hundred kids here. They're giving back to the community, such a good thing, man, coming back to giving back to his hometown. DA is a great dude, man. I play with DA. DA is just a great 
great dude, man. He's worked hard. He's done so well for himself. I'm super proud of him, man, to, to get to where he's been at. He worked his way from the bottom, starting at Huntington, and did what he had to do as a, you know, as a graduate assistant for Coach Saban and moved his way up to the defense coordinator position with the Chargers.